live from the world's capital markets, here are the financial headlines brought to you by Arise Academy. Good morning and welcome to our daily financial outlook. Join us today as we survey the business world for the latest events and updates in the markets. Michael is helping today from our trading room. The Ripple price has displayed a rather volatile price action since late March. This came amid woes about its case against the SEC, the class action lawsuit that claims Ripple Labs participated in an illegal securities offering of the XRP token. European shares ended higher, supported by positive earnings, especially reports from Deutsche Bank and Barclays that eased concerns about the banking sector's health, while Denmark's Simcorp surged on a deal with Deutsche Börse. Spanish oil company Repsol said that its first quarter net profit fell 20% from the same period a year ago, as oil and gas prices shrunk from the first three months of 2022. The pound-dollar pair made a minor upwards correction in the last session, gaining 0.1%. The RSI is giving a positive signal, which matches our overall technical analysis. The Bitcoin-dollar pair gained 4.3% in the last session, after rising as much as 5.1% during the session. The Williams indicator is giving a positive signal, which matches our overall technical analysis. The last session saw the oil gain 0.5% against the dollar. The ROC is giving a negative signal. The last session saw the Aussie gain 0.3% against the dollar. The stochastic indicator's negative signal is in line with the overall technical analysis. Germany's unemployment rate will be released at 0.755 GMT. Japan's BOJ monetary policy statement at 0.300 hours GMT. Australia's producer price index at 0130 GMT. The US personal income will be released at 1230 GMT. The US personal spending at 1230 GMT. The UK's CFTC GBP NC net positions at 1930 GMT. We hope that you've enjoyed today's market outlook. On behalf of all of us here, we wish you a productive trading day. Be sure to join our next review for the latest news and events from the financial markets. Thank you.